A city with history, a city with a future, and a city for the now. That is what awaits you at Port Winchester, a city for everyone. The first settlements were created in the late 1500s on the north banks of Port Winchester's largest island, Parada, by men seeking to set up convents to practice their religion away from the persecution they faced at home. The small monasteries they set up in the foothills of the island, while at first meant only for their own use, soon attracted wayfaring merchant ships, seeking a stopping point for their weary vessels and sailors. It did not take long for businesses to start popping up as individuals sought to provide the sailors with everything from food and drink during the day to rabble-rousing good times at night. For many decades, Port Winchester, then called Parada Bay, lived up to its name, holding little in the way of a permanent population, but instead acting as a haven for piracy. This of course changed after Admiral James Winchester landed a naval fleet in 1734, claiming the small settlement as sovereign land for the crown, and ultimately giving the area the name we know it as today, Port Winchester. Though there was a military presence on the island at that point, and though it was very strategically significant for the military, it remained rather small and existed almost solely as a stopping point for occasional military and merchant ships. However, in the early 1800s, upon the discovery of coal and iron deposits in the mountains of Port Winchester, the small seaside village experienced an industrial boom that caused the population to go from the hundreds to the tens of thousands within only a few years as entire families sailed over seeking employment in the growing powerhouse that was the Port Winchester iron and steel industry. This boom lasted into the mid-1900s, when the leaders of the now bustling city saw the era of iron slowly coming to an end for them. They followed the lead of a globalizing world and invested in a strong commercial sector and high-tech industry, creating a city for the new millennium. We here at Port Winchester value more than just a strong industry and commercial district, however. We also pride ourselves on creating the best possible lives for our citizens. Boasting a top-notch education system all the way from primary school to community college, Port Winchester has more per capita college graduates than any other single city in the entire world, as well as a top-tier university that draws students from around the globe. Aside from education, Port Winchester also offers great health care, fire, and police services to all residents of the islands, ensuring our citizens are happy, safe, and healthy. Of course, all 600,000 residents need a way to get around the islands of Port Winchester, which is accomplished by a robust public transport system consisting of buses for short commutes, underground subways for longer trips, and highways and roads connect you to everywhere you could possibly want to go. It's not just those that live here that love our city though, we are also a hotspot for tourists. Though our history may be rooted in maritime travel, the vast majority of our visitors come in through Port Winchester's International Airport, and what a sight they see upon landing. Just up the mountains from the airport, you can see some of the final remnants of Port Winchester's fascinating past. Or, if you're more in the mood for something modern, there are city centers that can offer you more than just a taste of what true city life is like. In the mood for something relaxing, why not check out our country club, or the beautiful beachside views surrounding the islands. With a temperate climate year-round, this destination is great for skipping the snow or beating the heat, no matter where you are coming from. If you're looking for something more exciting though, why not check out the internationally famous Emerald Island? where you can watch the Winchester Admirals play frequent games in their illustrious home stadium, or where you can visit the Emerald Island theme park. And if neither of those suit your tastes, there are more than enough dining and entertainment options to fit any budget or desires. Whether it's for live, work, or play, Port Winchester will have just the thing for you.